embarrassing Meghan Markle's latest letter is exactly what Queen feared. Meghan Markle's letter to U.S. politicians is what the Queen feared, according to a royal expert. Meghan, 40, had sent a lobbying letter to two huge names in U.S. politics, Nancy Pelosi and Chuck Schumer, this week. In this letter, the Duchess of Sussex called for access to paid family leave for citizens. Royal author Robert Jobson claimed Meghan has always been political. The Queen had known about Meghan's political views and ambition which could become embarrassing for the royal family, Mr. Jobson explained. Mr. Jobson said, this is what the Queen feared because now she's free to say whatever she likes. She'll now start talking about her political views and ambitions. And she might stir them up which then becomes embarrassing. Mr. Jobson added, she's sailing close to the wind, but will they say anything, the royals, no they won't. The fact is they knew this was what she was going to be doing. She was always a political girl. Since the age of seven she was writing letters to Hillary Clinton. Despite saying Meghan has always been political, Mr. Jobson emphasized in his interview with The Mirror that this could not be the case for Prince Harry. As Prince Harry is, according to Mr. Jobson, a prince of the realm, then the Duke of Sussex could not get involved in political matters. He said, if it was Prince Harry doing it I would say that's a slightly different thing because he's a prince of the realm. And he is a British citizen and he's kind of bound up by everything. Meghan had written on paper headed the office of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, saying, I'm not an elected official, and I'm not a politician. I'm writing to you at this deeply important time, as a mom, to advocate for paid leave. I grew up on the $4.99 salad bar at Sizzler. I knew how hard my parents worked to afford this because even at five bucks, eating out was something special, and I felt lucky. I started working, at the local frozen yogurt shop, at the age of 13. I waited tables, babysat, and piecemeal jobs together to cover odds and ends. I worked all my life and saved when and where I could, but even that was a luxury because usually it was about making ends meet and having enough to pay my rent and put gas in my car. I expect many of your constituents have their own version of that story, she continued, before attacking the U.S. economic system. Many of our economic systems are past their expiration date, and as you well know, too many Americans are forced to shortchange themselves when it comes to what matters to them. Meghan concluded her letter by acknowledging how politically charged things can and have, become, but said the issue isn't about right or left, it's about right or wrong. 